it's Rob. Welcome to Axel's <laughs> Kitchen. We just finished Sunday dinner here, and we're talking about our new channel, Axel's Kitchen. Now, we've been doing Axel's Garage for a few years, and we've had a great time, but what did we do at Axel's Garage? We kept going back into the kitchen and doing recipes and doing reviews, and we were cooking stuff with Grandma, and we decided that, being we all are foodies in this family, we would like to do something where we're cooking, doing some recipes, and reviewing some places. And we like to go out to eat, right? What's your favorite food, Em? Tacos. Tacos. So we like to go to Mexican What's places. Yours? What about the, the the senior big dummy? He's the big, big dummy. Big, big dummy, Rob? Uh, Italian. Anything Italian. Anything Italian. Well, and what about the little big dummy, I'm, Steven? I, I'm actually really smart. What is your favorite kind of food, Dum Dum? I don't know. He I could He's not even sure. I he never says no to anything if you put it in front of him. Yes. Baby scallops. Mama? I hate scallops. I like scallops. broccoli rob and sausage and macaroni. What about you? Me. I, I think my absolute favorite, favorite is a burger, and a close second will be pork barbecue. What kind of burger do you like? I like a, a medium rare cheeseburger. With a little char, I want it juicy, but I want it a little charred on the outside, with Swiss cheese and a fried egg. Where's the best place you ever got a burger? The best, I don't know. Diner? No, I don't know what the best place I ever got a burger is, and that's what, that's where the channel comes in. Because what we're gonna do is we're gonna go around, we're gonna go to Italian places, we're gonna go to Mexican places, and we're gonna go to any food place he likes. Oh, I got it. I think a burger would be my number one. And we're like gonna go to nice burger rare, places. Like juicy, like yeah. And we're going to review it. barbecue sauce on it. No, and, no. and something that we all like is... And then number two would be like pasta. No, that. Yeah. Really? Steven, what do you... I'm interacting. <laughs> 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 That's why I'm doing it. <laughs> and then something that we all like, which the area that we live in is western Nassau County, closest to New York City, is pizza. Because this is like the pizza hub. We have a pizzeria every... Mile. A mile, no, every maybe Half mile, quarter. quarter of a mile is a pizzeria, and all of them are really good, but some of them are a little better, and we're going to do some pizza reviews. This is, like we were saying, if you took Manhattan and chopped off the second floor and up on all the buildings, there's more pizzerias per resident in this part of Long Island than there is in New York City, because this is really the mecca of New York style pizza. New York City kind of got a little brick oven and coal oven and, and I call it fancy. Foo -foo pizza, fancy pizza, foo foo pizza. But the real regular pizza is here. And we got regular, which is Neapolitan, Sicilian, grandma. which is the square pizza that's thick. And then there's grandma, which is the square pizza that's thin. And it, each one of them has a different dough. Different dough, different sauce, different cheese. preparation, different cheese. Um, so it's not just the shape of a pie almost like pasta being different shapes. It's, everything's different. It's completely different. So we're gonna split them into different categories. And we're gonna to try to hit a place once a week. And then we'll do our own family recipes, we'll do some of our friends' recipes, and subscribers that want us to try and do a recipe, um, we're more than willing to do it. So if you wanna send a recipe in, uh, we'd be willing to try it, whether it's dessert. We tried our first cobbler, right? My favorite dessert is peach cobbler. And we did a review um, a couple weeks ago, and that video will be coming up soon, where I had the absolute best peach cobbler I ever had. It was more like a, a crisp than a cobbler, but it, they called it peach cobbler. I really liked it. So my wife made an attempt at peach cobbler, and it came out really good, but we're going to keep playing with it until we find the absolute best cobbler recipe. But peach cobbler and blueberry cobbler are my favorite desserts. What's your favorite dessert? Cheesecake? I don't know. I cheesecake. Or like like a like a moose cake, like a chocolate mousse. A cobbler? No. What about you? Banana cream pudding. Banana cream mm. pudding. With the uh, vanilla wafers in the top. Uh, <laughs> what do you like, Emily? A churro? Really? <laughs> <laughs> uh, do you have to you say don't that? make that for him? I never make that. His favorite dessert? You know, don't make it. I'm trying to make it more. I was going to say cheesecake. I had it already planned out, but he had to say it. <laughs> you could have said it too. you serve in the cafeteria. <laughs> <laughs> and you had to say, I never make that. No, I have to make it now. Um, like ice cream cake or dirt pudding. Dirt pudding? Yeah. Dirt pudding. What about you? Go ahead, 
Yeah, smile for dirt pudding. Yeah, yeah. Give the camera a smile for dirt pudding. No, she's gonna. You're gonna get the back of her head all the time. <laughs> Sorry. What's your favorite dessert? Crumb cake. Oh right, yeah. We had crumb Tiramisu. cake the other night. Oh, and tiramisu. Yes, that's close. But crumb cake. Yeah, I mean, I'll, she, it's her favorite is crumb cake. I'll, I'll and it was tiramisu. I said peach oh, yeah. cobbler. Oh, yeah. That's how we started this. I like so anyway, oh, yeah, that's like Axel's food. kitchen. Yeah. It's it's going to be fun like Axel's garage. It's going to be a little goofy. Ooh. We're not going to review anything on a scale of 1 to 10, right? It's going to be, do you like it? Do you really like it? How much do you like it? I really like it a lot. I come back here all the time. Or I never look to come back here or go somewhere else. I never want to come back here again. It sucked, right? And listen, if I was hungry and I was passing by, I'd stop and get something. I wouldn't go out of my way, that kind of thing. Or it's a real life review. I don't like doing that whole one to ten or giving it a number score because it's just too, it locks you in too much. It's, it's got to be a feel, right? It's got to be a feel. It's almost like when I ate that cobbler a couple weeks ago, right? What happened? I put my fork in it and I put it in my mouth and you could see just the look on my face changed. Like it was a heavenly look, like, ah. right? Right? Did you see the look when I get into that cobbler? <laughs> I didn't. You're like, this is good cobbler. Right? <laughs> when? Because huh? we were yeah. thousands of times, that first impression. Oh, you skipped that. that trip. Oh, man, that cobbler was so good. Mm -hmm. It was a barbecue place. It was the place that it was, was in Virginia. Way. What was that? In like, uh, the the, re the oh. PF, the mm -hmm. FP or PC. something. EB something or other. Well, well the, the video will be coming up. So that's it. Axel's Kitchen. It's our new channel. It's a spin-off of Axel's Garage. If you haven't checked out Axel's Garage, what are you, crossing forks? The world of <laughs> if you haven't checked out Axel's Garage, check it out. You'll love it, especially if you like cars and cooking. If you like cooking and eating and doing food stuff, cooking stay, in the car. Cooking in the car? Yeah. <laughs> stay, stay with us at Axel's Kitchen. Watch some videos. Have a good time. And please, send those recipes in.